welcome to my channel. Hello everyone, in this video we are going to learn 25 IICL exams preparation questions and answers. Question number 1, the maximum length of any crack, fracture, cut or tear that may be welded is. And the maximum width of separation is. The options are, A, 150 mm, 6 inch, 5 mm, B, 200 mm, 8 inch, 5 mm, C, 75 mm, 3 inch, 5 mm, D, 60 mm, 2 inch, 5 mm. The correct answer is, B, 200 mm, 8 inch, 5 mm. Question number 2. When installing a patch, grind the existing panel to bare metal with a grinding disc, from the cutteds on the exterior side. This will provide a clean, smooth surface for the exterior patch weld. The options are, A, 25 mm, B, 20 mm, C, 50 mm, D, 35 mm. The answer is, B, 20 mm. Question number 3. Patches should overlap the existing panel on the exterior by, in case of corrugated panel. The options are, A, 10 mm, B, 13 mm, C, 14 mm, D, 12 mm. The answer is, B, 13 mm. Question number 4. In order to allow complete weld penetration, clean the replacement component, bevel the edges to be welded to adjacent components to a, angle. The options are, A, 45 degree, B, 55 degree, C, 40 degree, D, 60 degree. The answer is, A, 45 degree. Question number 5. Inserting is permitted, on the outer inner profiles on front corner post, and the outer profile and J-bar portion, of the rear corner post. Is the statement true or false? The answer is, true. Question number 6. Section is permitted only on the outer profile, of a rear corner post including J-bar portion. Is the statement true or false? The answer is, true. Question number 7. Inserting is not permitted on the outer and inner profiles on front corner post, and the outer profile and J-bar portion of the rear corner post. Is the statement true or false? The answer is false. Question number 8. Section is not permitted on the outer profile of a rear corner post, including J-bar portion. Is the statement true or false? The answer is false. Question number 9, no full profile section of any kind is allowed, on front corner post. Is the statement true or false? The answer is true. Question number 10, full profile section, of any kind is allowed on front corner post. Is the statement true or false? The answer is false. Question number 11, an insert in the outer profile of a rear comma post except in the J-bar portion, must be at least in length or in the J-bar portion, unless it terminates at a corner fitting. The options are, A, 150 mm or 75 mm, B, 300 mm or 100 mm, C, 150 mm or 125 mm, D, 125 mm or 150 mm. The answer is, A, 150 mm or 75 mm. Question number 12. If the type of material in the corner post is not known, the replacement steel must be high tensile carbon or carbon steel, or the same or greater thickness with minimum yield points of 34 kg slash m or 50,000 pounds per square inch. Is the statement true or false? The answer is, true. Question number 13. Neither sectioning nor inserting is allowed, on the inner profile on rear corner post. 
Is the statement true or false? The answer is, true. Question number 14, a maximum of dash, sections are allowed in the outer profile of the rear corner post. The options are, A, 3, B, 4, C, 2, D, 5. The answer is, A, 3 sections are allowed. Question number 15, if many roof bows need to be replaced, such as when replacing an entire roof, do not remove all the old roof bows at once. Rather, leave every, dash, roof bow on 20 feet container and every, dash, bow on 40 feet container attached to top side rails, until the roof bows has been replaced. The options are, A, 3rd, 4th, B, 2nd, 3rd, C, 3rd, 5th, D, 4th, 2nd, there, answer is, A. Third roof bow should be reply for 20 feet, and fourth for 40 feet containers. Question number 16, if the type of material in the corner post is not known, the replacement steel must be high tensile carbon or carbon steel or the same or greater thickness with minimum yield points of. The options are, A. 60 kilograms, per square, or 50,000 pounds per square inch, b. 34 kilograms, per square, or 50,000, pounds per square inch, c. 120 kilograms, per square, or 60,000, pounds per square inch, d. 34 kilograms, per square, or 75,000 pounds per square inch. The answer is, b. 34 kilograms per square millimeters or 50,000 pounds per square inch. Question number 17, sectioning or inserting both are allowed on the inner profile, on rear corner post. Is the statement true or false? The answer is, false. Question number 18, if the type of material in the corner post is not known, the replacement steel must be high tensile carbon or carbon steel. Is the statement true or false? The answer is true. Question number 19, sections to tunnel bolsters, are not permitted? Is the statement true or false? The answer is, true. Question number 20, floor small holes up to, dash in diameter may be repaired using dowels. The options are, A, 12 millimeters, B, 8 millimeters, C, 13 millimeters, D, 15 millimeters. The answer is, C, 13 millimeters diameter. Question number 21 comma when repairing floors or replacing screws, install, dash with a minimum diameter of. The options are, A, zinc plated or other similarly treated self tapping screws. 6 mm B, normal screws, 5 mm C, dowels, 4 mm The answer is, A, zinc plated or other similarly treated self tapping screws, 6 mm. Question number 22, screws should be countersunk to a depth of, dash, below the surface. The options are, A, 2 mm B, 4 mm C, 3 mm D, 5 mm The answer is, A, 2 mm Question number 23, if floor plank is 150 mm, 6 inch, wide, how many screws should be used to sufficiently engage under structure properly? The options are, A, 3 screws, B, 2 screws, C, 4 screws. D, 5 screws. The answer is, A, 3 screws. Question number 24, according to IICL floor center support plate should be 5 mm thick, and 64 mm wide. Is the statement true or false? The answer is, true. Question number 25. IICL inspector, should check the locking rod for proper operation, by rotating it though it's full. The options are, 
A. 170 degree. B. 180 degree. C. 160 degree. D. 120 degree. The answer is, B. 180 degree should be rotated for proper operation. That's all for today, we have studied, 25 questions and their answers. Note down and memorize. See you till next video with 25 questions and answers. Your precious suggestions are welcomed. Please comment. Thank you for watching.